I just realized I'm never gonna be on the 30 under 30 list. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not. Jovan, give me what? She's goddamn rich. She's loaded. I'm Die, fool! Ah! The hell was that? Blast! Today we're gonna play a little game of tennis. Woo! Oh, oh the ball it is! That's Mass Boy! Yeah. Steve wins! While we try to get to know each other, let's pick some flowers. That sounds great. I have a, a surprise for you. Do you know that somebody's sabotaging it right now? Hey, son of a bitch! Brad, you'll always be my friend. Mom, I'm coming home. Just as soon as I'm contractually able to. Holy sh! This is what a bathroom should look like. Literally. Holy sh! Is there like poo everywhere? Hey guys, come to my bathroom. You know how they call a bathroom a throne room? I get it now. Best toilet ever. I can't wait to christen it. Da 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 da. What? It's a giant potty with a smaller with potty. With a smaller on it. potty on top. Oh, it's a pool potty. Hey! Why is it a pool gross. potty? Today I dubbed Joven this. King, or king of sh as he is full of it. Not an insult, but like, it's weird. It's weird that you want a toilet on a toilet and the toilet is also a pool. Can you explain that? Do you want to be swimming in the doo-doo? Oh, hey, I don't have a shower. Oh. Oh, hey, I was hoping to have some alone time with you. Pretty intimate. Uh, yeah. You know what would be cool? If we could sit down while, while we do this. This is, you know, Cool in a weird science kind of way. Sage, would you like me to wash your body? Yes, you want to switch? Yeah, I hope. Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> what a creep! What's up? Wait, are you peeping through the wall? <laughs> you found the glory hole. Sausage party! Damn it. I'm sorry our intimate uh, shower was. Sebastian's uh, back with his sausage. Yep. Yeah, it was interrupted. Perhaps later I can rub your body down. Wait a second. Uh, Sage, hey, Sage. Yes. Um, you came into the shower with me, but I was using Flitz's shower. Did you come in here looking for Flitz? Um, that's a, a little a secret that you won't ever know about. Oh! Damn it! Oh! Hey, what are you doing back here? Nothing, go away. You want some, you want some chicken? No, I'm good. Get away from me. Sure. I'm fine over here. Don't, no, don't. Ah, oh, you broke Oh, the hey, thing. guys, Alfred just said he used to work for Bruce Wayne, and he asked me if I've heard of him. This is true. I, I did get him off of the, uh, the set of Batman. <laughs> off of the set? <laughs> so I found a book here on Sage's desk talking about level five security clearance for some kind of diamond vault. Max. Max. Max, real name? Oh yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> that is my real name, yes? How can I help you? I found something that you may be interested in. Have you? Show me the thing you found of interest. Maybe this isn't your first choice of crime, but take a look at that and let me know what you think. Thank you, Craig. That is of great interest to me. Yes, Craig approached me with some interesting information. It appears some sort of safe has been installed in this house. And this safe is loaded with diamonds. So if we find the safe and find the diamonds, it could turn into quite a profitable venture. Sebastian's back with his sausage. Yep. Yeah, it was interrupted. Perhaps later I can rub your body down. Hello, Ram. I'm still kind of depressed, so I kind of want to be by myself. By the way, whoever made a freaking clear vault isn't the brightest person in the world. Typically, you don't want to show what's in the vault. Huh. And I found this tunnel, and there was a key card at the end. Should I feel bad for stealing her diamonds? No, she didn't pick me, and I was clearly the best one on the show. Oh God! Oh my God, what, what was that? What just happened? Nothing, what? everything's fine. Was that from outside? No. I am a little suspicious. Everything's totally of fine. Of the name coming from the basement. Oh, God. Nothing happened. Everything is A-OK. -okay. Guys, I actually have a family emergency, so I have to I have to go. What? Wait, you have a family? Yeah, they're well, bakers, remember? Know, I've, got, I've got a, a mom, dad, and stuff. Hey, Sage, how do you get down to the basement? I'll, I'll see you guys later. It was it was nice meeting all of you. It's kind of weird that you have to leave after a big boom. Did uh, you close? No, nothing up? happened. Everything is A-OK. -okay. Uh, 
You're gonna get in the limo that just sits there? No! I can't get in! There's so many bathrooms in this place. Why are there so many damn bathrooms? I'm just trying to find the basement. Oh, I get diarrhea a lot. Do you have irritable bowel syndrome? <laughs> Do you know where the basement is? Yeah. Greetings, Sage. Uh, hi, how hi, are Sage. you? Hi, Sage. I'm glad you brought somebody else with you. Yes. <laughs> Your diamonds have been stolen, Sage. They're completely gone. Now how the fuck is she gonna afford this house? This is supposed to be my meal ticket to, you know, having meals. Might be difficult to keep living in this house without those diamonds. My husband and I, we can figure it out. Now they're all gone and she doesn't care? Inside job, insurance fraud. It's insurance, Joven, it's not insurance. How many times do we have to have this discussion? Insurance. Perhaps we should question Bartholomew. Has anyone seen him? He left on a business trip. Yeah, he said he had a family emergency. I don't, he he I don't believe him at all. Him. Not one bit. I'll find the scoundrel. Yeah, his emergency is that he stole all your diamonds I mean, and he wanted to get away with all your diamonds. Perhaps he was just trying to open my eyes. A diamond is not a girl's best friend. A best friend is a girl's best friend. Hey, you want to hang out? I'm just minding my own business over here. No one was minding you at all. Greetings, Bartholomew. Oh, hello. I thought you left on a family emergency. I, I was just about to do that. Uh, but? But, uh, yeah, I, I, I had to collect a few things. Goodbye! <laughs> Perhaps you should take some improv classes, Bartholomew. <laughs> Where are the diamonds, Bartholomew? What di There are no diamonds! Where are the diamonds? Help! I'm through playing games with Help, you. he's got a knife! We found the scoundrel. Sage, we found them and stole them. You'll never catch me. We actually probably will never catch you. We seem to be running at precisely the same speed. <laughs> <laughs> ah! no! Thank you for the boost. Who's ah! this? No! Does he have the diamonds? He no! does. I found them. Have you? Yes. Hmm. <laughs> 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 What a shame if something were to befall you. Would you like them? I can yes. give them to you. Yes, hand over Our, the diamonds. Yes, Go yes. hand him the diamonds. I'm going to give you the diamonds. Thank you. I murdered Jacob, and then Craig and I took the diamonds. And then I took the diamonds from Craig. And now I have all of the diamonds. Kind of had a look in his eye. So I just thought that it was probably best to give him about half the diamonds. Oh, Sage. So, so good of you to see this. I found your diamonds, my lady. All three of them. Need there you them. go. <laughs> Oh. What a hero I am. Perhaps you should let me back into the competition. I can't do that, but I can give you the diamonds back. Oh. A girl doesn't need money when she's got so much. What love are you from Game of her. Thrones? A girl does not need diamonds to see. Today I, I realized that I had to namaste and and really think about the fact that love is what really counts. Not diamonds. Besides, they're not even my diamonds, they're ABCs, so. Mwah. I offered to give her back some of her diamonds, and then she said she didn't need diamonds, which I find quite odd, because everyone needs diamonds, you know, for stabbing utensils and whatnot. Oh, all right then. Goodbye. Are we, oh, I was backing it up for you if you didn't. Oh, you were back? Wait, I thought you said you wouldn't well, let me back into the competition, though. I'm confused, Sage. The competition doesn't mean... You're sending me mixed signals. <laughs> You're That's so, because I'm so coy. You're so coy. very alone right now. Oh, I'm so coy. Oh. That's not coy. That's annoying. Come closer. <laughs> Come closer, dearest. Oh, no, damn it. No, now I must run away to make you ponder about our relationship. Your butlers are now witnessing things. All right. I suppose I'll see you later. That silly minx, I wasn't quite able to catch her. Sage. Yes. I, uh, I recently had some time to stop by the store, and I thought you could use... Uh, something nice to wear over your head and maybe hide some of whatever you got going on in your face. You got me a little face mask? There, enjoy. Oh, this is, is this gonna make me look younger? Uh, yeah. How does it look? Oh, it actually, yes, it goes over the tooth quite nicely, the, the dead tooth in your mouth. Okay, I'll see you later. Craig is just the kindest. That can only mean that he's just trying to figure out who I am and my style and what I like. I don't really give a shit about Sage. Don't, don't tell her I said that. Please don't, because that would hurt my chances. I don't really care about Sage that much, but she's got a real nice place here and I'm trying to stay, so I figure I might as well make her some presents. Uh, step one, make her a sword. You might have to use that later. Step two, make her a nice uh, helmet. I told her I bought it someplace expensive. She doesn't know it's her diamonds. 
All right, everybody, I've got a special announcement. Today, we're gonna be going to the beach. So get your beach clothes on, because we're all gonna have a little competition over there. Look at me, I'm ready for some summertime. Are these jorts? Oh, hey. nice. Hey, Looking what's up? Good. Thanks. Uh, I, I don't work out at all. All right, Sage, I've, uh, I've safely secured your diamonds where no one will ever find them, and I'm ready for a swim. Oh, wow, I like your nips. Hey, I'm in Mac's real name's room and I just found a bunch of diamonds. God damn it. Thank you. He literally just put the diamonds in his bedside drawer. I found a very secret hiding spot. It doesn't seem like anyone here is interested in sweets. No one's asked me to bake anything for them. So I think, I think the diamonds are safe where they are. Wealth is not about diamonds or money. Or a big mansion, All right, for that you matter. talk too much. <laughs> <laughs> is everybody here? All right, everyone, exit the limo. Oh my god, there's lava! Just yeah. exit the limo. Oh my god! I, yeah, I exited the limo. There's another, there's another doorway. Oh, Max, you're such a prankster. Ah, uh, yes, a fun, lighthearted prank. Now would be a good time to mention, I'm actually terrified of the ocean. Oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gentlemans. Today we have a cha oh my gosh, that's creepy. Uh, today Hello, we have loves. a challenge. It is a horse race on the beach. Oh wow. Because there are only three people left in the competition, all three of you guys will be racing. Everybody else who is not in the competition, including myself, can get a horse and saddle it as well so that we can uh, go watch. And whoever wins, wins a date with me. You know, I didn't really care about going on a date, but I do like winning. I really like winning. I don't do a lot of it in my life, hence the living at home with my mom. There's nothing that makes a person hungrier and thirstier than seeing a bunch of men on horses just riding as fast as they can. Are you horsemen ready? Yes. Aye, aye, Captain. I am. First one to the finish line wins a date with Sage. Woo. On your marks, right. get set. I've never rode a horse before. Horse! Yeah, nice, nice song wow. that you made. Hi ho, Joey! Oh jeez! I'm in the. I'm, I was almost in the water. Yeah, this is, they're going fast. Oh my gosh! Woo! Oh wait, no, I got stuck. Yep, I'm, I'm messing up too. Who's in the lead? Me! Oh wow! Oh my Yay. gosh! Joven in the lead. I want love! Oh no! Something he's caught up. Water! Luckily, I've got a seahorse. <laughs> that was a really dumb joke. No, no, oh no! I'm dying! Are you? Oh wow, no! did I pass you? I think I passed you. Yes, I got stuck! Leave it to me to really joven it up there at the end! That's why you don't drink and ride, Joven. Go, Black Booty, go! Go, Black Booty, go! Oh, I'm not in the race, I just like go riding. Black. No, I'm not talking to you, Max. No, Joven was talking to me. Oh, I thought you thought I was calling you Black Booty. Oh wow, what the F? Whoa! Shortcut! Ah! Maybe not a shortcut. <laughs> the ultimate man for Sage can get through any obstacle. Is that obstacle your chastity belt? Yes. Uh-oh. Uh, my horse might be drowning. Yeah, suck it. <laughs> I actually, yep, I can't, yep. We're out of the race. <laughs> oh my gosh. Go. Figure it out. Do water. it for love. Come on, Woo. come on. And? No! Oh, yeah! Yeah! Hey, yeah, black booty! I'm mad at this horse. It's going in the water. <laughs> the horse just follows rules, though. Nah, he's staying in the water. Oh. Come enjoy your prize! Hey. So close! I messed up at the end! Yeah, I was I was in the lead pretty far there, and then I went into the deep water and it dismounted me. At the end of it, Flitz came out on top. A black steed on a black steed. You know why? Because blacks are faster. Black horses, not black people. I mean, black people might be faster. Have you heard of Usain Bolt? Care for a swim? Thank you, Black Booty. I chose wisely. <laughs> so you and I will be going on a date, Fliss. I'm super excited. Me too. Yeah. Uh, uh, you know uh, I chose oh Black God. Booty? Yeah. Because it matches your beautiful bikini. Uh, Damn it. Oh, it's not even a good one-liner. <laughs> Hey, look at Black Booty. He's out in the deep. You can't. That's a hate crime. <laughs> Drowning animals now? <laughs> yeah. Excellent work. Since I won, my uh, the plan for us is a beautiful boat trip with some fishing. Ooh. Yeah, it's a great way to bond, eh? That's a, that's a nice date that you've set up. Have you ever seen a gator? 
Um, I've been to Florida. This, is this a part of your land too? Is this like your beach? Oh yeah, all of it is mine by way of ABC. What's your family life like? Um, you know, my dad wasn't around. Mine either! He drank a lot. Oh. He reminds me a lot about, uh, like, Joven. He always wore a silly suit, and he was always drunk. Joven and I, we, we, we get along because of that, I think. I wouldn't call them issues. <laughs> no, I don't have issues. You talk about, like, how your dad wasn't around. I didn't really have a dad around. And, you, I, like, you're talking, like, we could build a family. And I've always just kind of wanted to be you know, the thing that I never had, which is a great supportive parent. That's deep. That's deeper than I ever thought about it. It's deeper than this ocean. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 bubbles. But yeah, so um, your tooth. You have enough financial means to utilize it. So what is the aesthetic choice behind the, uh, the single chomper? It's, it's to open up my beer cans. Oh, <laughs> that's amazing. So you've turned your sacrifice into service. That's right. Wow. So uh, this is a personal question. If, if we do wind up copulating, you know. Uh, Cop. How do you feel about uh, BSFN? The best service for men? No. I uh, am all about servicing men. BSFN is uh, butt stuff first night. Oh. It's, I mean, well, it's also, it's a, it's a, it's a trust exercise. You know, it's like, just breathe. You start with the tongue, move to the fingers, and then the dingers. <laughs> Listen, I, I know I've come across as pretty coy and really shy, but, um, this bitch ready? Hey, hey. You know what would be really great right now? Weed. <laughs> How about we go back to shore and have a nice little pony ride back to the mansion? That sounds great. It was a great time to bond and get in touch with her without directly touching her. At least for now, you know what I mean? Hey, direct touch. Well, we got into talks about the other guys today during our date and like whether really they get it or not. Because I mean, it's pretty obvious. I, I like to wear dresses, yes. I like to um, have a bunch of boys in my house, yes. And, you know, I'm guy, so what, I don't really understand what the big deal is. If we can become great friends, then we can become great family. Because you know what they say, your friends are the family you choose. And then if they piss you off, you remove them on Facebook. Uh, uh what the? Why, hello, Craig. How did I've you? I've been expecting you. Aha! Aha, uh. What? Uh, What's that? God damn it. Never mind. Oh, let me, Enjoy the maybe music. if I do it. I hate this house. Not sure what was supposed to happen with the switch, but uh, that, that guy's cool. I, I like that guy. You know, he, he's a funny he's a funny character. I think Sarah is mad at me. It's my job to serve. Is there anything I can do for you? Guys are always so nice to me. <laughs> I know a couple things you can do for me, Gina. Oh, this is a party I can get into right here. <laughs> I got bored waiting for them to get back from their date, went up in the trampoline room, bounced around with Sarah, and we were all having a good time. Then Gina tries to leave, but, you know, she's not gonna just leave like that. I'm gonna push her back in that trampoline room, obviously, but she, she wasn't having it. But I'll make her have it. That came off weird. I, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna do anything she, without consent, you know. That, can we just, let's, can we cut this part from the, from the confessional? This isn't, I don't want people, this is gonna make me look bad. Hey, well, get out of here, man. This is my party. Me, Gina, and Sarah are trying to have a good time. You're just in here being a dick. Their job is to serve. It says they're, they're asking me if I, there's anything they can do for me. Yeah, they said that to me, too. He, she says, nah, you're always so nice party. to me. Sometimes I just feel like dancing. Are you in a bush? That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> That's so great. Oh, hello. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I am not constantly hiding in bushes. I don't... I... Excuse me. Nice to be home. That was a wonderful date. Sage! Sage, come out to your balcony! Oh, dude, you drew balls on the lawn. No, what? Hey, God, yeah, come step oh, up to the ledge. Oh, they're balls, my favorite. To Sage, I wanted to show you what you make, how you make me feel on are the inside. Are you the phallic part? That's hot. 
Oh, it's so phallic. Oh my gosh. Yeah. No, it's not. It's a, it's a heart. Oh my goodness. Oh, no one's. I just got chills. No one has ever done this for me before. I need you, babe. What a touching display. You know, I'm glad he didn't try to write something this time because we haven't had time to sit down and list, learn how to read and write just yet. It's my message of love. I don't know what the f that says, though. Now for the grand finale. Oh, I'm out. Wow. The grand finale if was really weak. If you can promise that in the bedroom. Yeah! Your bedroom will burst into flames. What are you... Today is a very difficult decision. I'm left with three bachelors who I feel like really get me. One is drawing balls on my yard, and that to me shows that he really cares. I I'm not really sure about Craig yet. He didn't give me any attention. He just doesn't know how to open up just yet. And Flitz, he and I had wonderful conversations, and we went fishing, and we really got down to talking about each other and what we want in our lives. As hard as it is, I think I've made my final decision. All right, gentlemen, three of you are left, but only two will be out of the friend zone. Today I went on a date with Flitz, and we talked about wonderful things. So you other two motherfuckers should be really scared right now. Boy. Ah! Whoa. What the fuck? Get what? back down there, bro. <laughs> so this show has hit a new level of embarrassment for me. Not only did I not get picked out of all those other people, they made me be a living freaking rug. As you can see, once you are in the friend zone, you become an area rug. Are there, wait, where the hell is, where's Max? Oh, I was just, um, I was just admiring your posterior, excuse me. Where is he going? What? I also realized today that wealth is not about a mansion or money, diamonds, or the things you wear. That's why I really like the fact that we're all in our casual wear, to really see who we are. The first rose is gonna be going to Flitz. Yeah! That makes sense. Yeah! That makes sense, they went on a date. It's been an amazing day. She said I, I, we had a good date. She learned a lot about me. I learned about her. I really like having a friend to talk to, somebody who really gets me. Before you make your final decision, I know he drew testicles on your lawn with fire, which by the way, that was a little, that was a little dangerous. Um, hard! I made you this blue phallus. You seem to be into those. Oh wow, look at that. It looks it's really rock hard all the time. Why is uh, Matt or Matt? Where, where is my Matt going? Where is he going towards the Where is my Matt going? Oh my God, why is... <laughs> Craig, maybe he just needs the attention. Is he gay? I played my last little ace in the hole. I gave her the sword. I told her it was a dick because uh, I don't know if anyone else has caught on to this. Um, turns out Sage is a man. No one else is seeing this. I've, I can't believe that I'm the only one figuring this out, but yeah, it's a dude. I'm not gay, but I'm still gonna try to win because, you know, I want to I wanna live here. This one and only other rose is going to a person who I feel like has been really trying, trying very, very hard oh, that ain't to get you. to me and has made the extra effort to try and get to know me. And so this next rose goes to Craig. What? Well, I mean, sure, yeah. What? I guess I'll take oh. it. There. Oh. What? <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, Joven. Craig gets a rose? Dude is here for free lodging and food. He's not even I trying. need somebody who's gonna be my man, not somebody who's my father. I and ain't your daddy! I, no, but you've been acting just like him, actually. Does your daddy make firework shows in front of your goddamn balcony? Oh. I hate you! Joven, if you can just no. stand up here. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Joven can't read or write. I need my children to be able to read and write. You know what, I don't even care. There's something wrong with this sage chick. She ain't even that hot. If you're gonna be that crazy, your body must be banging then. And her face looks like it got ran over by an ugly machine. F this noise, I'm out. Hope you guys have been enjoying Block of Love. Who will Sage pick? Find out next time. But in the meantime, if you guys want to see us fail over and over at bottle flipping, make sure you check it out over here on the left. And over here on the right, we've got something just for you.